One casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Don't shoot. I'm with Jacob. He told us to wait for you, but these bastards found us first. Oh God, are you all right? I'll live, but I need a safe place to rest in case the invaders return. There's a cave across the bridge over there, a wolf den. They won't look there, but I can't clear it out on my own. Not like this. If you could kill them, We'll have a safe place to regroup. I might even have something for that pistol of yours. Can you help us? Yes, of course. Stay out of sight. I'll be back. Thank you. Jacob was right about you. Someone in here, it's safe. You can come out now. Got to be hiding in here somewhere. I know there's a trail. Blood. It hurt. Stop! No closer! I'm not with Trinity. My name is Lara, and your gun isn't loaded. I can see the cylinder is empty. The firing pin never worked anyway. You're hurt. I just need to... Sit down for a moment. Laura, was it? I'm Nadia. I could use your help. What can I do? My grandfather snuck out of the village in the night. I think he's headed for the Wicked Vale, where the witch Baba Yaga lives. I was trying to catch up with him when the invaders caught me. Before I was born, the witch killed my grandmother. Grandpa always talked about revenge, but I never thought he'd actually go through with it. There isn't much time, and I'm in no condition to go myself. We have to find him. I'll head...
that way and see if I can pick up his trail. Thank you. The path to the veil is through the cave to the east. Laura, I found a radio on one of the invaders you killed. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. I can monitor the invaders' frequencies from here while I patch myself up. I'll let you know if I hear anything useful. What more can you tell me about the wicked Vale, Nadia? My people stay far away from that place. They have for centuries. When the Soviets were here, they tried to build an outpost in the Vale. But they angered Baba Yaga, and she drove them all mad. Grandpa told me all about her. She lives in a magic house that can walk with the legs of a bird. Do you believe all that? The house with the bird legs? I trust Grandpa. He was in the Gulag when the Soviets took my grandmother into the Vale to help them study the ruins. The witch killed her, and he's never forgotten that. But a witch straight out of a Russian folktale? It sounds unlikely. Just be careful. Something is in the veil. Nothing good happens in that place.
Lara, hang on. I'm picking up a transmission. You need to hear this. Overwatch! Come in! We need a hit! Immediate extraction! What the hell is that? Did you hear that? That was the witch! Something's definitely happening out there. Whatever it is, we'll get to the bottom of it. <sighs> is there any more sign from Grandpa? Are you still on the path to the Vale? No, but I'll head back and look soon. Just take the wooden path along the cliff. It'll lead you right there. No need to go inside the old temple. Head down to the wooden walkway along the cliff. There should be a rope leading to it. That path will take you straight to the veil.
There's a small camp here. Sounds like Grandpa made it that far, at least. You're almost into the Vale. Nadia, I think I found your wicked veil. I don't know if it's Baba Yaga, but there's something out here. Be careful. This is her land. There's <coughs> some sort of pollen drifting here. Flowers. What did you say? What did you say? I, I can't understand you. Something's wrong. My head is spinning and... Oh no. Oh no. It's... It's... It's too late. It's too late. Well done. <laughs> no. Must be dreaming. Is it real? It can't be. Just... Keep moving. <laughs> Lara. No, it can't be. No, wait! I'm close, love. I'm close, love. I'm close, love. Wait, where am I? How far does this path go? It's not real. Not him. Dad! Get out of here! There is a truth behind the wall. I just want to leave, please. No, no, this isn't. Me, it is too late. Me, it is too late. Me, it is too late. No. No. Someday. Someday. You'll understand. You'll understand. Who are you? Come on, see.
Hallucinating. God, I hope I was. Hallucinating? There, there is a flower in a valley that can bring on visions, but the effects are too weak. Any idea what this place is? I see ducks and pipes. Soviet from the looks of it. It has to be the outpost the Soviets built to study the ruins. My grandmother was a scholar and they brought her here to help with her research, but the last time Grandpa ever saw her. There was only one survivor, an officer who stumbled out a few weeks later. He said the witch made them do things. Someone's been in here, recently, building on top of the ruins. What do you see? Some sort of makeshift distillery. It smells just like the flowers. Oh, shit. Of course. She's refining the pollen, weaponizing it. There's no magic here, Nadia, just someone very clever. Wait, but if it is just a person, then wouldn't the pollen affect her too? If she can resist it somehow, then so can we. Maybe I can connect it to that rope spool.
Whoa. That should be enough food. Time to get the bottle closed. It's been weeks since these bastards. I found something. One of the prisoners wrote down a formula that might counteract the effects of the pollen. It has to be for my grandmother. The witch killed her and now she's gonna help save Grandpa, just like in one of his stories. Uh, Nadia. Have faith, Laura. Hop back to the Soviet installation where we met. I'll help you find what you need. Initial contact was made.
All right, Nadia, I'm back at the installation. Any advice on where to start looking? Okay, first, the seed pods. The flowers grow inside the caves around there. There's never enough of them to make you sick, so you should be able to gather some safely. The livers should be easy. The deer around there feed on the flowers, so you'll just need to track them down. As for the insecticide, I have an idea where we might find some. Grandpa taught me to read Russian, so I'm going through some old equipment manifests to see if I can find out where they stored it. I'll let you know when I find it.